counterattack continues. Ukrainian army reached Novoprokopovka. On the southern front, the elite units of the Russian army are crushed under the pressure of the attacks of the defense forces of Ukraine, which reached Novoprokopovka. The U.S. Institute for the Study of War has released information about this. It is noted that from the beginning to the middle of August, Russian troops moved units of the 7th and 76th elite airborne divisions to Orykovo. Their counterattacks in the Novoprokopovka area suggest that the Ukrainian army has reached the vicinity of this area. If the Russian command actively uses these units to repel the attack of Ukrainian troops near Novopropokovka, the already degraded units of the 70th and 71st motorized rifle regiments are at risk of losing their combat capability. Units of the Russian 42nd Motorized Rifle Division are still located in Tokmak. This shows that the Russian command has not equipped the multi-echelon defense in the south of Ukraine, Institute for the Study of War said. If Ukraine can then secure its advance around the cities of Vobov and Novopropokovka, it can advance to Tokmak, an important waypoint on the way to the ultimate goal, the capture of the city of Melitopol. Armored vehicles, including American-made strikers, breached the main layer of the infamous Surovikin defense line, named after Russian general Sergei Surovikin, which consists of trenches, mines and anti-tank obstacles. The Institute for the Study of War judged for the first time last week that armored vehicles had likely penetrated the main layer, although it was not immediately clear whether the position would hold.